It's no secret that many governments globally don't always operate with the best interests of their citizens at heart. These civil servants often fail to resist the temptation of using state resources for their own personal gain, thus creating the most corrupt countries in the world. Things like nepotism, taking or giving bribes, and manipulating processes to win government bids or tenders are common forms of corruption. While many of the most corrupt countries in the world are developing nations, a few developed nations also struggle with this skirt. In this guide, you'll get an in-depth list of the 29 most corrupt countries in the world based on the records of the Transparency International Corruption Index. Number 29. Lebanon. Lebanon is the ultimate Western Asian destination for history buffs and beach babies. This primarily Arab nation boasts many historical Roman ruins, preserved castles, mosques, and stunning Mediterranean beaches. But, after the fatal Beirut explosion in 2020, it is clear that Lebanon's corruption is a ticking time bomb. The government system allows corrupt officials, including those from opposition parties, to partake in corrupt activities without fear of the judicial processes. Number 28. Guatemala. Guatemala is a country in Central America that's awash with volcanoes, ancient Mayan sites, and lush rainforests. It neighbors Mexico to the north and would be a great destination to add to a Central America itinerary. However, due to corruption, tourism and other business sectors have struggled to flourish in Guatemala. Government officials engage in corrupt activities with little regard for civilians. Number 27. Central African Republic. The Central African Republic is considered one of the poorest and most fragile countries worldwide. Despite its abundance of mineral resources, the country only has about 5.4 million people with a low literacy level. The sparse distribution of people throughout the Central African Republic also contributes to the country's fragility, as it adds to the lack of human capital. The Central African Republic also went through a coup in 2013, which further exacerbated the corruption of senior government officials. Number 26. Cambodia. This Southeast Asian country boasts verdant natural attractions, gorgeous beaches. Neighboring two popular Asian destinations, Thailand and Vietnam, Cambodia has the potential to be a tourism haven, especially for travelers who like history, architecture, and fewer crowds of attractions. But the country has not managed to capitalize on this potential due to a weak judicial system that fuels corruption. Businesses can expect to pay bribes for licenses and operating permits, while the police's impunity constantly harasses civilians. Number 25. Afghanistan. Afghanistan is another country on this list that is characterized by years of conflict. Despite being regarded as a perpetual war zone, Afghanistan is rich in natural resources, including fruits such as grapes, pomegranates, and melons. The country's conflict has had dire consequences on its economy. Hence, international aid constitutes about 90% of the Afghan economy. But most, if not all, of this aid is withdrawn, packed into suitcases, and flown out of Kabul, headed to destinations like Dubai. Number 24. Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe is a landlocked country in southeastern Africa known for its stunning natural beauty. It is home to one of the most visited landmarks in Africa, Victoria Falls. The country also boasts the ruins of Great Zimbabwe a medieval city that thrived on cattle herding, gold mining, and trade via the Sofala Swahili port. However, after years of authoritarian rule by former President Robert Mugabe and crippling sanctions by the United States and its allies, Zimbabwe is in a socio-economic crisis. This feeds into the migrant crisis across southern Africa. Many government officials are known to use patronage and cronyism to exploit the country's abundant resources. Taking and soliciting bribes from the police is common practice. Number 23. Myanmar. Formerly known as Burma, Myanmar is a Southeast Asian country that boasts a spectacular cultural diversity with over 100 ethnic groups. The country is mostly Buddhist and has an interesting array of British colonial architecture dotted across its major cities. The corruption in Myanmar stems from the military's totalitarian rule. In 2015, Myanmar held its first election after 50 years, and political stalwart Aung San Suu Kyi, a Nobel Peace Prize laureate, won with a landslide victory. But that was short-lived. In February 2021, a handful of generals in the army staged a successful military coup. This was actually caught on camera as a fitness instructor was doing her exercise routine. Number 22. Iraq. Iraq is mostly known as a war-torn country whose administration crumbled after the United States invasion in 2003. 
but not many know that Iraq is actually the location of ancient Mesopotamia and home to an array of talented poets, sculptors, and painters. The current situation in Iraq is a bit tricky. While the U.S. mission ended in 2021, several United States military personnel are still in the country as peacekeepers. The corruption in private and public enterprises has deterred any potential for foreign investment. Iraq's ongoing political and humanitarian crises further fuel the lack of government intervention, and public officials have continued to take bribes and act with impunity. Traveling to Iraq is largely not recommended for U.S. citizens due to high levels of violence and kidnapping. Number 21. Honduras. Another Central American country marked by corruption is Honduras. This mineral-rich country boasts an abundance of hard and soft commodities, from minerals to tropical fruit and sugar cane. Corruption is widespread in Honduras. Patronage and clientelism syndicates control the economy, making it unattractive to potential investors. Add bribery and drug trafficking to the mix, and you have mistrust in state institutions from civilians, a security crisis, and a growing migrant crisis. Number 20. Azerbaijan. Tucked between Eastern Europe and Western Asia, Azerbaijan is a country full of modern and ancient wonders. You'll find a fusion of futuristic and historical buildings dotted all over Baku, the capital. But Azerbaijan's known business compliance risks and political corruption are deterrents of foreign direct investment and tourism. Corruption in Azerbaijan's oil sector is most accredited to patronage. While there is an anti-corruption mandate in Azerbaijan, the weak judiciary allows corrupt officials and police to act with impunity. Things like extortion and bribery are common practices here. Number 19. Sudan. Sudan is a fascinating country with tons of tourist attractions. In fact, Sudan has more pyramids than Egypt. Once the largest country in Africa, Sudan is also home to large amounts of mineral deposits, including gold, iron ore, and other base metals. However, many Sudanese civilizations have yet to benefit from the country's wealth. Cronism and patronage have made government officials direct and indirect owners of stakes in many companies, thus leading to a compromised economy. The lack of transparency also exacerbates the frequency of civil servants requiring bribes from citizens and private enterprises for services that they are entitled to by law. Number 18. Eritrea. Situated in the Horn of Africa, this tiny nation is one of the most militarized on the continent, with more than 20% of the population serving in the army. This hyperinflated the military workforce and hence puts pressure on the national budget. Patronage and cronyism are among two of the most prevalent forms of corruption in Eritrea. Many citizens seeking civil or judicial services have reported having been asked for a gift or bribe in return. High-ranking military officials and generals have a monopoly of control over the citizens and hence corroborate many of the corruption and illicit crimes. The police are also accused of abusing their civil servant roles. They often facilitate the release from prison of their friends and family members. They also do this for private citizens who can afford a gift. Number 17. Guinea-Bissau. Guinea-Bissau is one of the smaller countries in Africa, and yet it ranks high among the most corrupt countries on the continent. Known for its lush national parks and diverse wildlife, this West African nation has rampant corruption in its security forces. Government mismanagement and lack of accountability have crippled the judicial system making it hard to investigate and prosecute criminals' activities. Corruption in Guinea-Bissau doesn't only happen at the top. Many citizens have admitted to being asked to pay a bribe at least once by public officials. Number 16. Republic of the Congo. Not to be confused with the DRC, the Republic of Congo, also known as Congo Brazzaville, is home to the second largest rainforest in the world and the famous Pygmy tribe. This Central African nation also boasts an incredible amount of mineral deposits, including cobalt and copper. Tourism opportunities in Congo are abundant due to its vast biodiversity, with more than 400 mammal species living in the rainforest. But corruption is a key hindrance to the tourism sector. The president's right grip on power makes the state susceptible to patronage and a compromised judicial system. Number 15. Democratic Republic of the Congo. The Democratic Republic of the Congo DRC is abundant with mineral resources, from gold and diamonds to cobalt, tea, copper, and coltan. But the DRC ranks among the five poorest countries in the world. Corruption in the DRC permeates through all governmental levels and sectors of the economy. Clientelism, patronage, and rent-seeking have destroyed fair competition and have thus left the country unattractive to foreign investments. Number 14. Turkmenistan. 
Turkmenistan is a landlocked country in Central Asia known for its ancient archaeological sites, like those of Nisa and Merv. These are major stops along the ancient Silk Roads, so there is great tourism potential. However, corruption in government procurement and the awarding of licenses have been prevalent in Turkmenistan for years. The president's family members and close in a circle occupy high-ranking positions in politics, education, and trade. Number 13. Nicaragua Known for its dazzling lakes and volcanoes, Nicaragua is often a destination overlooked by tourists. This Central American country has come under the corruption spotlight with allegations of lack of political freedom and lack of transparency about the state budget. The corruption in Nicaragua is endemic. Political power is monopolized by two leaders. President Daniel Ortega and his wife, Vice President Rosario Murillo. This cronyism and nepotism have led to dire effects on the electoral system and the regard for human rights. Number 12. Comoros Not many tourists know about Comoros. This archipelago along the Mozambique Channel boasts crystal clear beaches, verdant cliffs, and charming colonial coastal towns. However, the country's lack of systems and infrastructural development has led to a decline in control over corruption in Comoros. The scourge of corruption in Comoros is rampant from the judiciary to civil servants and security forces. Citizens are known to be obliged to pay bribes to evade regulations, obtain fake police reports, and avoid arrest. Number 11. Chad. Chad is a landlocked African country rich in oil, gold, and uranium. The country has been alleged to have high levels of corruption from the quasi-independent judicial system, which is often influenced by government officials, to punitive police behavior. Corruption in Chad has been normalized, though. It is often expected for locals and tourists to pay bribes to police and other state forces when crossing checkpoints. All this has led to Chad being one of the poorest countries in the world, although an oil pipeline from Chad to neighboring Cameroon generates billions of dollars every year. Number 10. Libya. Libya is another country deeply impacted by the Arab Spring years after the initial uprising broke out in 2011. After the deposition of its leader, Muammar Gaddafi, Libya collapsed into civil unrest among various factions. The turmoil has since wicked the country's political system, allowing for corruption to go unchecked. Care that with ineffective corruption monitoring and the complicity of political figures, and you have one of the most corrupt countries in the world. Number 9. North Korea not much is known about North Korea by the outside world, due to its intense dictatorial, totalitarian regime. This has led to a lack of transparency on food security and human rights, which in turn has allowed corruption to become widespread. Although North Korea's ruler, Kim Jong-un, has vowed to mercilessly deal with the scourge of corruption, graft has been entrenched in the country since the 1990s. A Trace International report ranked North Korea last on a list of 190 for countries. This is after the country scored quite high in risk for four key indicators, notably on civil society oversight capacity and the expectations of business to government bribes. Number 8. Haiti. Haiti has been in a social crisis since the deadly earthquake in 2010. The country has not recovered from the economic and infrastructural devastation caused by the disaster. Since 2011, corruption has hollowed out state coffers. Organized and armed gangs have expanded their territory of control, and political stability has worsened, culminating in the assassination of former President Jovenel Moose in July 2021. Number 7. Equatorial Guinea Equatorial Guinea's corruption problems stem from an authoritarian government that sees the president and his close network of elites live lavishly of the country's oil revenue. Mismanagement of funds and no rule of law has led to rampant corruption and arbitrary detentions, torture, and unfair trials. In 2021, a French court found the president's son and vice president of Equatorial Guinea, Teodoro Obin Mank, guilty on embezzlement charges. He was most guilty of flaunting his wealth on social media. He owned a Rolls-Royce Phantom, two Bentleys, a Maybach, a Porsche, a Ferrari, a Maserati, and two Bugattis. Number 6. Burundi. Despite many efforts towards transparency and good governance, corruption is still rampant in Burundi. This is because corruption is systematic in the country. Bootleg activities like bribery and cronyism trickle down from high-ranking officials to street-level public employees. Burundi's ruling party's neo-patrimonialism policies have reduced the country to low-level government rankings, which have turned foreign investment and caused social discontent. 
The country's failure to fight corruption in political and social settings keeps Burundi high on this list. Number 5. Yemen Yemen's nine-year-long civil war has often been dubbed a proxy war between Saudi Arabia and Iran. Whether that's true or not, the conflict in Yemen has created a humanitarian crisis, and children are the most affected. Over half a million children under five years suffer from severe malnutrition, and a child under five dies every 10 minutes due to preventative causes. The war has led to a lack of government accountability and a non-existent system of control. Patronage networks run the country's civil affairs, leading to extensive numbers of ghost workers, which puts an increased strain on the state's budget. This network also oversees government contracts and often exploits small businesses through arbitrary fines. Number 4. Venezuela Possessing over 300 billion barrels of oil, Venezuela's wealth in oil and other natural resources has led to political upheaval, a socio-economic crisis, and corruption. Venezuela's food insecurity, overcrowding, and deteriorating infrastructure exasperated the situation. Government officials and their family members have been accused of participating in illicit crimes such as drug trafficking. Some of these ill-gotten funds are alleged to have ended up supporting President Maduro's 2013 presidential campaign. Number 3. Syria The Syrian civil war broke out as part of a larger movement across the Middle East and North Africa. The Arab Spring was the genesis of the ongoing conflict in Syria between the military and insurgent forces. The war has led to an influx of funds and arms to opposing forces and relief from international institutions. But these relief funds have often become mismanaged thanks to corrupt officials. The most prevalent forms of corruption in Syria include bribery and soliciting. Number 2. South Sudan Despite being the youngest country in the world, South Sudan's governmental leaders have been accused of the same level of graft as the most corrupt countries in the world. This oil-rich country became a republic on the July 9, 2011, but it soon descended into civil war in December 2013. Corruption by government officials has thrived under these conditions. Sudan's leaders are said to have diverted over $74 million in the last two years. The president, Salva Kiir admitted to over $4 billion being looted from the state since 2012 through patronage, embezzlement, and bureaucratic corruption. Number 1. Somalia Ongoing conflict, insecurity, and lack of a central government have kept Somalia in the world's top three most corrupt countries in the world for the last two years. Care that with an infamous culture of piracy, and you have a crisis on your hands. Corruption has a lot to do with these socio-economic issues that affect locals and tourists alike. According to a United Nations report, over 70% of Somalia's government assets have been exploited and diverted for private gains.